Yukon Firearms Act. So the Yukon is um, the opposition party, I think, up there is trying to create a firearms act very much like Alberta and um, Saskatchewan. That's what it is uh, to yeah. um, to try to protect the the residents of their province to protect their their personal property from the feds. Yeah, that's right. So the Yukon party is the opposition party, and they've been pushing really hard with the Yukon liberals to get them to institute the same type of law that the, or, uh, legislation that we've seen in these other provinces. There's two main components to it. Number one, they would regulate and license confiscators. So basically, if the liberal government ever does get around to kicking in our doors and taking our stuff, nobody in um, Yukon would be able to do that without being licensed by the province, which of course, would probably never be issued. And number two, they're looking for their own provincially appointed CFO. So uh, they're still one of those provinces that doesn't have their own. And then, of course, there was a lot of information in there that they would also consult with hunters and indigenous communities and just experts in the north because they have the largest number of wilderness carry permits in that province and they want to protect that. So all that to say, we'll see what happens um, in the uh, coming months with that. But um, there has been some positive reaction from the Yukon Liberal Party. So, yeah, stay tuned for more. But lots of really great people in our community pushing hard on that. Yeah, that's interesting. So in 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 that way, I think it's similar when they're saying like, well, you have to have a license to be a, uh, a confiscation agent of firearms. And we're yes. not sure whether or not we'll issue that license. That's uh, that's what they would call in the United States may issue, not shall issue. Yeah, that's right. Yeah. <laughs> anyway. I don't want to call it a roadblock, but it would definitely block the road. Yeah. Anyway, yeah. it's 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 all fun and games when you're the federal government and you can just push down whatever you like until people start resisting. And, and I think any reasonable federal government would maybe stop for a second and go, wait a minute. Are we are we on the wrong side of this thing, but not this government? So not this government. We'll no. Yeah. Remember, if you don't stand up for your own ability to own and use firearms, who will? Join the CCFR or donate right now at www.firearmrights.ca.